Hi to Chaco. Ooh, did I miss something? What is this? B smash in the base? B smash with piggies, killing uh, burrows, killing peons, killing blade masters. Wow. Everything is just taking so much damage. Let's go, Orc Worker, take my energy. It's for Burba saying. Chuck, you're missing the Boar Harass. I'm here. No, I'm here, guys. If we see the Boar Harass, we see the Beast Master, we see the Piggy Master, and we see the Blade Master, the, the Burrow is going down, the Beast Master is going to TP, I guess. A Blade Master is uh, just fine. Just fine. Archers, Tree of Life. Oh, Foggy. Uh, the Grunt, somehow, he was doing something over here, I, I assume. And Hunter's all going up. Ancient of War going up. This is such an exciting game already. I was expecting another boring game. No, that's not what I was expecting. I was expecting something less exciting than this game. And it was just more exciting than I expected. Now we see the Beast and Master. What's some piggies he's going for this, uh, this ogre? This ogre is going to die. Did he lose the Ancient of War? That looks like he lost the Ancient of War. Probably thanks to the Grunty Punty. Uh, there is the Claws of Attack. He also didn't get any XP. From even that ogre, so maybe the Grunty Pit is still the XP. The Blade Master is still the XP. There, that's for sure. Uh, Blade the Archer is dead. The next Archer is going to die. The piggies are killing these four soul trappers. Uh, well, maybe the Blade Master will get the kill. Blade Master got the kill. Blade Master level two. Beast Master so weak and pathetic, and arms are sweaty. Uh, spaghetti. This ancient war. Is, oh, Archer got the castle. The healing self was already done. In fact. Maybe the archer is going to die. He does have dust. First cancel the Ace of War, of course. Easy cancel. And he's getting Huntresses now. The yeah, Ace of War defending himself. But he is taking a lot of damage. He is uh, being repaired here. We have a Grunt. The Grunt takes a lot of damage. Maybe the archer can kill the Grunt. Grunt at 46, a 30 now. They bash are just killing Wisp. The Wisp hiding in the tree. No, no, hide it. Uh, wait, the, the Wisp just detonated. Even though the Blade Master used a Wind Walk uh, too early before killing the Wisp, Angel of War and the Beast Master together. Maybe they can kill the Blade Master, but it doesn't look like it. Even though he has Boots and Claws of Attack plus 9, he's still not strong enough to kill the Blade Master, but maybe now he is. Blade Master down to 100 and uh, very low hit points. Go for the Grunt, but the Orc Worker is already at tier 2 though. It's getting a Beastier, a TC, and a Spirit Lodge. No, Beastier, second Beastier, no. Nothing. And the nothing so far. This Grunt is going for the Wisp. What do we have here? The Beastmaster hunting down this Grunt. And look at the Wisp block there on the Grunt. That's a beautiful Wisp block if I've ever seen one, but it wasn't good enough. Playmaster kills the Wisp. And now the Beastmaster going for... I, well, that was not attacked by the hunters, cancelling the healing self on the Blade Master. There's a, a snare. There's the Spirit Lord. Blade Ma the Beast Master walks so fast with the boots. We have two guns, super low hit points. And we have an expansion up. Uh, we have a Forest Tool Trapper there, attacking the expansion. Ancient of War in his base. Is he going Shockwave? Maybe he's going Stomp. Maybe it goes Endurance Aura. That would be amazing. Endurance Aura first. There it is. Endurance Aura. On the grunts. Now they walk so fast. The Blade Master as well. Is he going to creep this? And maybe buy a Berserker? He's going to creep this. And buy a Berserker. Maybe for a Shadow Priest as well. It's uh, pretty useful against the Beastmaster with the little piggies. And little birdies. And all them other uh, summons. Maybe little boris. Boar. I don't even mean boar. Bear. Bear. Bears. Little bears. This uh, this one went down. The piggy went down. Still level 1. Is it finally going level 2? Finally level 2. Maybe. Perhaps. Maybe. There he kills it. Oh, Tom of XP. That's nice. And what is this? Oh, Archer. Be careful, Mr. Archer. 40 hit points. Picks up the item. Lionhorn or Stormwind, the shittiest item in the game that you can get there. Well, Boots of Quad, the last for him, wouldn't be that great either. I'm just running for a little life. 41 spike and 40. This Moonwall is going down. We sense over a birdie. But we have a level 3 Beastmaster now. The Tom of XP helped so much. The Beastmaster was level 1. He went, he's level 3 now. It's like a different level completely. Compared to the Blade Master as well, the Blade Master. 
It does have slippers though. Slippers on the Playmaster is amazing. Okay, the Tree of Life under attack. Here come the Huntresses. Berserker is first, of course. He was in the back. We have two piggies. We have the archers to blow hit points. Even a Zeppelin to save units. Not units that are ensnared, but units that are not ensnared. This uh, unit could not be saved as ensnared. This though, this Huntress, there she goes into the Zeppelin. And he drops him again. There's no shockwave yet. All these units begging for shockwave. The TC is like, I can't shockwave. I can't, I'm sorry. Blade Master. Oh, wait a second. The first of setup, a first of Berserker went down. Now the Blade Master hunting this Huntress. The Huntress has is the hunted. Okay, well, what do we have in the Zeppelin? A Beastmaster. Can you defend against Blade Master with his Huntresses? DC is creeping. There's uh, some more spirit walkers being summoned. Raiders being trained. Huntress is being killed. He did get that four soul shadow priest, by the way. Wait, does the other player? Foggy got the four soul shadow priest. To heal himself. Oh, this uh, Huntress goes down. Can he surround? Can he surround the Blade Master? What is that? That's uh, oh, he used the info potion. Muddy. This is Muddy, guys. Muddy the Mud Golem. TC is still level 2. He only grabbed this. Could have easily grabbed this in the same time as well. Of course, he's healing up. Maybe uh, he was too busy microing his Blade Master. We have a Kodo. Okay, he's going for this creep camp. Blade Master Akinos. Two healing souls here on that uh, Beastmaster. That was risky, lol. Well, he's almost level 3. Maybe if he would get a tome of XP, but... Oh, the birdie, how much XP does he give? More than 24? No, 20. <laughs> 20 XP given from the birdie. TC is still only at level 2. 496 XP, he needs 4 XP. 4 XP, anyone has 4 XP lying around? Please, TC needs 4 XP. Level 2 shockwave. Oh, it's gonna be so beautiful, these huntresses. I think they're tough, but it, well, we do have two healing scrolls. They're probably probably pretty tough. Uh, he has one attack upgrade. He did calf, so yeah, he did sell that attack, uh, that armor. I mean, that the uh, Lionhorn of Stormwind. TP's to the expansion to defend it. 64 supply against 50. This game is still far from over. Do we have any slow? Maybe muddy. Maybe you can cast a slow. There's a slow on the raider. Here come the wisp. From the gold mine, even no, not from the gold mine. That's a beautiful oh, wait stomp, beautiful stomp, level two stomp, is beautiful. Uh, let's look at the next stomp. There, it's like six hunters. They're not attacking at all. They're just over there, just doing nothing. Uh, this hunters is uh, slowly dying. So there she goes. The Kodo, of course, ate a very tasty hunters that tastes like blueberry. This hunters here being surrounded and killed. These are orc units, though, pretty low hit points. We still have one more healing scroll. Let's uh, use speed scroll, but got detonated. By a wisp, at least half of it. And now the the mud golem trying to slow units that are retreating. How about the TC? Sure, he will get this TC. That's uh, worth it. That's a nice skill. By Foggy. This game started all out so bad for Foggy. But Orc Worker, I guess, doesn't know how to play how to play the mid game against this strategy. Because uh, Orc Worker is losing this now. Or do we see something? Do we see something? I see something. I see Raider low on hit points. I could see Grunt low on hit points. I see Kodo with a blueberry cake inside his stomach. Oh, Hunters, man. Blueberry cake. So tasty. Worker doesn't know what the fuck to do. Well. A player's force is what, do, what are you supposed to do? Shadow Hunter second would be my guess. Instead of TC second. Uh, some items here. He buys some new healing scrolls. Greater po potion of greater healing is amazing. 
Stampede. Murdy always wins the game. Mass Radio versus this tower up the base and go tier 3 for tower upgrade. Kirby had a special stat for this. Oh, there's a, a piggy. Let's see what item he gets over here. He drops his item. Yeah. Drop the item. Shitty item so he can pick up a better one. Over goes down. We have muddies. Two muddies here. If one muddy always wins you the game, what does two muddies do for you? Doesn't mean you're gonna lose the game. Doesn't mean you're gonna win the game even harder. Doesn't mean you're gonna win the next game as well. Does the winnage carry over to the next game? Is that what happens? Beastmaster almost level five. By the way, the amulet of spell shield works against nothing. There's no spell. There's a snare, but that's not a spell. There is a critical strike, but that's not a spell. The stomp. That's not targeting your hero. So amulet of the spell shield does not work. He's going to sell it. Maybe we'll get an amazing item over here. Let's see what he gets. And a toe, maybe. Toe of experience is amazing. The rope of the Magi is also amazing on a Beastmaster. For more level 3 piggies. I assume level 3 piggies, right? We have a fight here. The mud golems. Three mud golems, guys. Three muddies. They're like triplets. Oh, that stomp hits like four, five, four. One, two, three, four, five. Five uh, Huntresses. There's a heal scroll though. One Hunter's door. There falls all the slow here by the Muddies. There's another Stomp hitting uh, four to uh, Huntresses this time. They Master just kills a Muddy with his sword. Of course, these other two Muddies are sad, but they, they know they're fighting. They know they're fighting a uh, life or death fight right now. They cannot mourn right now. They can mourn later, maybe after the fight. These Master, do we have any piggies yet? Any level three piggies? I haven't seen any. Maybe they got dispelled. Maybe they are still alive somewhere on a different map, on a different place. Uh, Beast Bash is taking a lot of damage. He has to TP out, I think. He's, he's losing this fight, actually. There's a TP out. Orc Worker, super good position still. And uh, can he kill the expansion now? I think he can. 50 Spike is 59. Stomp is just too strong. Level 2 Stomp. And level 3 Critical Strike is just it's too much. Hunters just cannot keep up. He's still at uh, a tier one. No chance for worker. Well, it looks like he uh, has a pretty good chance. Where are the bears? They're in a different game. The blade, or, or, or if you are talking about the Misha bears, by the way. Yeah, I mean, uh, I guess the hawk is better. Some nice wisp they can detonate if they want. There's a nice uh, stomp. Oh, what's that? Look at the stomp. Hit the level three piggy. piggy. It does splash damage, by the way. Piggies with splash damage are just amazing. There it goes, the piggy. Uh, we have some detonates here on the left side. The muddy is fighting as well. It's Huntresses. They're all going to die. 236 critical strike. All the Huntresses just die. There's another piggy. Very angry piggy. He kills a raider. Just that's how angry he is. Now he's killing another raider. That's just... I've never been that angry myself that I kill raiders. But this piggy, he's that angry. Uh, the rest of uh, Pokey's army is dead. There's a G. And there it is. Was anyone here riding on a bus with me last night in my dream? No, I was dreaming about Warcraft last night. Actually, I was dreaming that uh, I was casting a game and the Dryas, there were a bunch of Dryas, were keep, killing a Keeper of the Growth. But then he let the Keeper of the Growth go, even though there was no reason to. He could have just killed the Keeper of the Growth, but the Keeper of the Growth just, for some reason, he missed my code or something. Let the Keeper of the Growth go. And then I woke up and I was like, Shit, I have to go back to sleep. I want to go back to sleep. See what happens. Let's see if he ever catches the Keeper of the Grove. Uh, he needs to kill the Keeper of the Grove. And uh, but then I was like, no. Nah. You know what? I have to uh, cast GCS soon. I'll just wake up. Blade Master here against a Demon Hunter. No bottom. No, Priestess of the Moon. Attack. Easy win. All, all is very good, of course. This uh, Lightning Shield doing some damage here against the units around her. Like all three of them, in fact. Beautiful position there. Here comes Mr. Demon Hunter. Mana Burn, 26 Mana Burn. This guy is dead. Picks up a new Circlet. Circling. Oh, Circlet is so good. Picks up a Manual of Health. 
That's so nice. Meanwhile, Blade Master, he's so slow, man. He's so slow at creeping. Can he ever creep this in time? There. Claws of attack. Plus six. That's uh, that's the uh, that's the item the Blade Master wants, and this is the item the Demon Hunter wants. But the cloak maybe is nice as well. Bad. Uh, oh, there's sheep hidden over here. I thought the demon hunter was manning like a sheep. A player's forces are under attack. Well, there's, grunt, there's a burrow defending the grunt here. Samuro level 1, Hellborn level 2. You bought the circlet. His burrow is so vulnerable, but on the other hand, it's so nice to have a peon in his burrow and to throw the spears, spears at that demon hunter. What item did he get here? Uh, mantle of intelligence. Okay, okay. It's not. It's not a slippers of agility. It's the second best item. He he will take it. Second best item. Sure. He just used the dust. He's going for this uh, first observer. Demon hunter sells a cloak of shadows, buys the boots, no staff. Just yet. Cloak of Shadows here for the Blade Master. That's a pretty shitty one. A player's forces are under attack. Player's forces are under attack. The archer kills all the Murlocs. Tome of Strength there on the floor. What is this? Hunter's Hole. Hunter's Hole, guys! Hunter's Hole for Foggy. What does it mean? What does this mean? This means... Dryads. And the grunt is here to scout it. He knows exactly where to scout. He knows exactly where uh, Foggy places his hunter's holes. There he sees the hunter's hole. He's like, okay, dry it. Foggy gonna catch Please this. Maybe. Attack. And just get the... There it is! <laughs> there it is. Cancel on the hunter's hole. And he's going... Uh, Ancient of Winds after all. The hunter is creeping here. Cast another Cloak of Shadows. Blade Master gets Soapy Mask. Sobby Mask is, of course, not that great in this matchup. Because you don't get a Shadow Hunter second, you get a TC second. Sobby Mask is not that great on the TC. A lot of other items are much better than the Sobby Mask. But if you get a level 5 TC, but this map you don't get a level 5 TC very fast. Level 5 TC, of course, would be so happy with the Sobby Mask. It does have the Mantle of Intelligence, which works uh, pretty well with the Sobby Mask. I use this as a dust, but Blade Master is not here, but it is here. There is the Blade Master, but he's too late to, to steal the item anyway. He steals the level 3 Kobold. But Illusions there for the Beast Master. Demon Hunter is already level 3, by the way, guys. And this Sobby Master just means that Mana Burns are gonna hurt extra much. Mana Burn for 69 instead of 60. Chaco, have my baby, please. Uh, what's what's his name? Her, her, her name, maybe. Is your baby a girl or a boy? And we have the Ancient of Winds up here. Do we have Shadow Hunter? We do have a Shadow Hunter. We have a baby seal as well. Demon Hunter runs for his life. He has the boots. He runs super duper fast. It's a Yeti. A Yeti? You have a baby Yeti? That would be cool. I could uh, keep him as a pet. Sure, send him over. Uh, Tome of Strength is nice there. He picks it up. Demon, uh, Shadow Hunter creeping over here. The Blade Master is he gonna scout now the Ancient of Winds? Uh oh. Is he gonna scout it? By the way, he did go Shadow Hunter. So the item, the, the Shobi Mask is a bit better, of course, than on the TC. He uses the dust. He sees the Blade Master. And he's going for the Sasquatch. Blade Master, he sees the Blade Master. Cannot let the Sasquatch, uh, I mean the Sasquatch, is that family of the Yeti? It's kind of the same, right? So you have a baby Sasquatch? Or is it like a different breed? He stops out the Demon Hunter, he gets his, he kills the Sasquatch. No! Tuna Vicious Baby, no! <laughs> Wrong hero, Jabay did. My baby's called Worker 4, he needs supervision. Oh, okay. 
No, I'll, I'll buy you, baby, once it's released. We have a level 3 uh, Blade Master now. I'm sure he's gonna pick level 2 Critical Strike. Actually, I'm not sure what he picks, because he does still doesn't know he's playing against Roots of the Talon. He has a sentry word over there, though. A player's forces are under attack. I live right near the real Sasquatch, really? Do you have any pictures? Any videos? Or is that uh, illegal to take? Shadowhunter, let's see what he gets over here. Boots of Quatalas, that's insane for the Blade Master, of course. That's a good item. Boots of Quatalas is so insane. We have Master Druids of Talon here soon. Of course, the, by the way, he didn't get Serpent Ward either, did he? I think he got Hex and Healing Wave. There should be no chance here for Orc Worker in the late game. But maybe right now, this is his chance. 36 supply against 49. Do we have TP? We do have a TP for Foggy. And he uses it. He's adept. Guys. TP home. Why does he have three of them uh, lined up in this one? Only one in this one. Maybe cancel this one. Maybe get another one in here. That would be so smart. A player's forces are under attack. A player's forces are under attack. He comes over for uh, he comes over for drinks on the weekend. Does he drink a lot? Does he drink more than you? Yet he's Asian. Sasquatch is from NA. Okay. What about the European one? You have a European one as well? Ni hao. Xie xie. Uh, there's a there's an ensnare on the piggy. What an ensnare. Beastmaster still level 1. Are under so, good job by Orc Worker creeping. But now the Beastmaster is level 2. And we all know these hero levels are already better for Foggy, or they're kind of better for Foggy. Beyond goes down. Foggy at 49 supply, Orc Worker at 54. Does he have the healing scrolls? He has one healing scroll. He has. No, oh, he has an info potion. No second healing scroll, but this said he has a Shadow Hunter. Maybe with the Shadow Hunter, you don't need the second healing scroll. Per, or, uh, yeah, just a healing wave there is good enough. Uses the replenishment, rejuvenation, replenishment potion, the purple potion to rejuvenate a bit of mana. Foggy has a uh, pretty good chance here, but Worker uh, just went to 60 supply. Here come the Raiders. The Raiders are still 0-0. Zero, zero. And the Berserker. There's a bunch of fake uh, Shadow Hunters. Three fake Shadow Hunters. Which one is the real one? Well, the one with the Rejuvenation Potion, maybe? <laughs> that is a, <laughs> quite a mistake of our Orc Worker. Uh, gets a uh, Mana Burn there in the face. Uh, these Druids of the Talon, though, in the back, they're taking a lot of damage. He only has five? He only has five Druids of the Talon? What's happening? How come... Wait, he just lost a bunch of them. What What did I miss there? You see one, two, uh, do that Druids of the Talon, more of them dying here. Uh, Beastmaster and the Demon are taking a lot of damage. Blademaster, Beastmaster, I mean, dies. And some more Druids of the Talon as well. It does look like Orc Worker is just going to win here with the Shadow Hunter, who's already level four. Blademaster, also already level four. There it is, GG. We have, uh, and again, out of Elder's Hero, no Panda first this game, no Beastmaster first this game. Over here, we have uh, an altar here for uh, Orc Worker. Probably a Blade Master first. He's getting some peons. We'll see. Did the Foggy and Orc Worker already play a best of three a few days ago? I'm sure they did. <laughs> What's predictable about Foggy is that whatever Moon recently plays, Foggy will try to emulate. Maybe that's how Orc Worker knows exactly what uh, what to do against Foggy. A Demon Hunter, guys. Demon Hunter first here for Foggy. How 
unexpected upwards. And here we have a Blade Master, guys. What Blade Master are we gonna see? Is it gonna be Leroy Jenkins? Is it gonna be Kajin? Is it going to be Mazuru? It looks. If you, if I look at his face, it looks a bit like uh, like a mogul. I think it's mogul. It's Jubei. Oh, his face kind of looks similar. Uh, hi, hey, hey, hi to check out. Thanks for these streams. It's great to watch. Thanks, Zinaros. Zinaros. I'm glad you like them. Blade Master, of course, goes for the level five. Mr. Uh, Mr. Shadow Fury, the Demon Hunter. What can he do? What can he do? Nothing. Okay, Blade Master kills his level five. Picks up the Boots of Speed. That's a pretty good early game item for free. I mean, for you know, half price for well, for free. However you want to put it. The Demon Hunter Shadow Fury. What can he do? Is he going for the Burrow? The Blade Master is pretty low on hit points. Oh. No dust though. No dust. The Blade Master, Jubei has the dust. Jubei is the ugliest. It's hard to see. Uh, it's, so, it's such a small picture. Before I select it, of course. After I select it, I see his face over here, which is uh, pretty big. You can see his teeth uh, sticking out. You see his beard as everything you want to see. You can see. But before you have to select it, it's uh, such a small picture there. Blade Master gets a Cloak of Shadows, not that great. There's another grunt. Burrow up here in the background. Instant War taking some damage to Blade. A Demon Hunter got a Claws of Attack, he's level 2. Blade Master also level 2, Jubei level 2, Shadow Fury also level 2. Uh, he finds a grunt here, maybe shoot the arrow in his back. No, Archer was hesitating. She was like, I don't want to shoot him in the back. I don't want to be a betrayal, betrayer like that. Okay, she does shoot him in the back. I thought she was more honorific. I thought she wouldn't shoot someone from the back, but that's what she did. The Blade Master and the Demon and the Grunt. Hunting down the demon hunter, he's going home. He's going to drink some moon juice. Look how tasty it looks! Just all blue, clear water. Oh, and he drinks so much of it. That's so good. That's so tasty. Now he goes out again. He does have both staffs. He's probably oh, he's gonna easily easily cancel something. Did he do a slow tech? Or foggy just a super duper fast tech? I see one, two, three grunts. The piggy is is walking in. Is he moving the the peons? Like Lin, no, he is not. No block there. What is Worker doing? What the fuck? Didn't he see Lin games? Even the, the Chinese orc did it. Pinga, I think was it Pinga. This is gonna be easy cancel. F 44 mana burn, but this is cancelled. And now it's gonna waste some more time. Stuff out. Oh, this grunt takes so much damage. This is uh, a real poor day. It's uh, Friday the 13th. Uh, this grunt remembers this day for the rest of his life. Well, I mean, I mean, yeah, I mean, it was the last day of his life. I guess there's not much to remember after that. We have a TC second here for uh, for worker. This piggy is going to try to cancel again. Guess not. It's so Archer. He doesn't realize he has dust. 34 mana mana burn. Stops out the Archer. TC. Two grunts. He has two grunts to creep with, because one of them did die. Beastmaster, drink some nice moon juice. So tasty. Love tasty moon juice. Is Mark going to try to creep that? Without the third grunt, of course, it's much more difficult to creep. Unless you want to creep with your Blade Master. But Blade Master just crit for 68 damage there on the Demon Hunter. Picks up the... Drops the Boots of Speed, gives it to the Demon Hunter. He's going to fight against the Blade Master. 
almost surrounds it with the piggy, the archer, the demon hunter, and the, the beast master. But I think he could just kill the archer there anyway. But he would be able to do a lot of damage to the blade master. Here comes the tier two. It's going for this burrow. This burrow is so easy to kill. Uh, but not if we have six peons repairing it. That's a lot of peons to repair our burrow with. Blade master, just going for the archer. We have a raider. Does he have a snare? He's upgrading the snare right now. The piggies are targeting the raider. Meanwhile, Mr. TC is almost level two. Claws of attack, of course, very nice for the blade master. We have Tinker, Tinker third, guys. Stops out that archer. There's some dudes of the Talon, they're still adept. He's getting the master uh, upgrade. Meanwhile, you see worker creeping over here. We will get level 2 TC and a nice tome, tome of knowledge. Who is gonna pick it up? No one just yet. Meanwhile, uh, Orc Worker is scouting the fact that Foggy is creeping here. The Foggy with the Fairy Fire scouts the fact that Orc Worker is scouting him. Orc Worker is over here with the Blade Master. We have a uh, birdie. No shockwave. But the Tinker picked up the item. I'm not sure. I don't. I do think Orc got the kill there. Not Night Elf. Yeah. No way Foggy got that kill. Uh, this Raider taking a lot of damage. It's going to die. That's a dead Raider. These guns as well. Well, these dunes in the back are just fighting against one piggy. Uh, Pocket Factory tried to uh, block the Blade Master, but he gets out safely. <laughs> nice position, worker. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't the best position to fight. But now, is he going for this item? Is he still very fired? He is. He's like, he, he doesn't care. Just going for this item. Let's see if it's an amazing item or a shitty item or somewhere in between. Meanwhile, we have uh, Foggy keeping over here. He still has only level 2 Demon Hunter. What did he get? Skull of the Beast is. Uh, is. I don't know. Forcing Battle Drums, though, is really good. That's a really good item. And a nice rune there to heal back up. The TC is almost level 3. The Blade Master is level 3. I'm sure he will pick level 2 Critical Strike. And here we have some more units dying here. Ring of Regeneration is pretty good. He has t two TPs here. Maybe uh, he, sells, he sells one. Maybe a misclick. Bought two TPs. Or he bought the second TP. He sells one. Maybe he was planning to buy a Scroll of Healing and he accidentally bought a Scroll of Town Portal. I mean, I'm sure they look very similar when they're lying uh, down in the shop. And he didn't realize, he just paid with credit card, didn't look at the price, didn't realize that there was 350 gold instead of only uh, 250. And it was a pretty costly mistake. He has two healing scrolls. Oh, but here comes the, uh, the raiders. Raiders. Well, it's creeping over here with the TC and the Blade Master and some uh, Spirit Walkers. And <laughs> now Foggy needs to rebuy TP. He did use the TP. If he had the second TP still. His heroes are still level 2. 3 level 2 heroes against 2 level 3 heroes. Don't think that's good. You just. You know, the level 3 Demon Hunter, just, that's the main point. That's so important. After that, the level 3 Beastmaster. Level 2 Tinker, who really cares? If he could give this XP that he has on the Tinker, 250 XP. If he could give that to the Demon Hunter to get him to level 3. And to the Beastmaster to get him a bit closer to level 3. He would certainly do that. Blade Master with two level two uh, info potions. That's super duper good, of course, against the uh, Night Elf. 
He could give one to the TC. Short one. I mean, you can use the, the info potion on the TC to dodge the mana burn. You only have to dodge one mana burn for a second shockwave. But with all these healing scrolls, probably not worth it. Here comes the Blade Master Jubei. Getting hungry. I want to eat another rice cracker. <laughs> if it's uh, if it's not over yet after this, I'll eat one more rice cracker. I promise you guys. A player's forces are under so if uh, if Foggy wins this, kills a peon. He does have level three demon hunter now. It's uh, Foggy staying under fifty. He's going over fifty now though. Fifty one supply. But he doesn't have a DP. Comes to fight. The birdie is uh, over here, by the way. It's out of the fight. Okay, there. Uh, 174 critical strike. The Demon Hunter fighting in the front here. But there's no Blade Master to kill him. Okay, there's a Blade Master. Use the Info Potion. He's trying to kill the Demon Hunter. Uh, there's the Info Potion. Use on the Demon Hunter now as well. Uh, remember, there's no TP here for Foggy. He needs to fight the same here for uh, for Orc Worker. No TP for him either. He's, uh, he's going for the Tinker with the Blade Master there. The Demon Hunter stops to the back and TPs. Oh, wait, what? Okay, he bought the TP with the Demon Hunter. Stopped on the Demon Hunter. Bought the TP. Stopped back in and TP'd out. A player's forces are under attack. Let's see what item we get here for Orc Worker. Scourge Bone Chimes. Okay, that's a pretty good item. Pretty good item. Especially on his peons. All his vampire, all these peons. Look at their, their eyes. They become vampire vam, vampions. Vampions is what they the call them now. A mix between vampires and peons. You see, what does he get over here? Mantle of Intelligence, level 4. Okay, well, do we have another TP here for Foggy? Oh, no TP, what? He's just gonna kill the shop, gonna kill some Burgos, but he's not going to TP out. Of course, he can do the same shit, but actually, though, no, the staff of teleportation is still cool down. He's just gonna base trade. Do we have pillage here for Orc Worker? I don't see it. No, no pillage for Orc Worker. But still, this is uh, Raiders, they are pretty good at base racing, from what I've heard. Uh, but the uh, peons are going to die in the burrows as well. Foggy, is he just gonna commit? I guess he's committed. At this point he's committed, right? There's nothing he can do to save his base. He built a tree of life over here. We have an amazing base race on our, on our uh, hands, guys. Well, do we have any peons left? That's the question. Yes, we have two peons here. He's built a, a war mill. These vamp peons, of course. Does he have mana for a town hall? Not yet. Not. Did he not get pillage? Why didn't he upgrade pillage? Or did he? No, he did upgrade pillage. Okay, never mind. He upgraded pillage. Does he not scout this, uh, this tree? No. We have some wisp all over the map, though. Oh, this is going to be cancelled. But the altar is still up. He can just cancel easily, easily, and the build. Uh, then he has all the time in the world to build another ancient of uh, tree of life somewhere. All these buildings are going to fall, and then it's just going to be a war mill. But I mean, why build a war mill right next to the altar? Everyone now knows where that uh, war mill is. Even Foggy. Remember, he can stop. Okay, actually not with the Angel of War. Actually, you still can, I think. You can staff a unit to the only building you have, which is the altar. He could have cancelled the Wormhole, maybe. It would have been all in, of course. Instead, he wants to fight. Uh, but I don't think... Can he win the fight? There's a Mana Burn on the TC. The Blade Master going for this uh, this Pocket Factory. And I'm kidding, the Pocket Factory was pretty good. It's pretty faster. It's worth the Info Potion. This Druid of Ten here goes down. 
We have a heal scroll here used by Orkworker. Does he have more? No, he doesn't have more. Neither does the other player. I think his staff here is uh, pretty necessary. And he loses the... No, does not lose the demon. Actually, he cannot kill these two buildings actually anyway. Uh, Orkworker came in to uh, fight in time. The Tinker here takes a lot of damage. It's GG, guys. It's a 3-0. Foggy loses to Orc Worker 3-0. Uh, we'll see Foggy again next week, I guess. That's a good thing here. And Orc Worker is qualified for the Open. Ball Play Open Cup. Which uh, is the third qualifier. After Focus, after Happy. We have now Orc Worker. This is amazing.